So we will bring the curtain down on an absolutely wonderful first day's race, and then with the you know the national hunt chase. This is our four miles as a naught to one twenty. Isabel Reform for David Robertson's the top one. Charlie two, Thomas Rogers, Crossmaster John Morgan, not now, never James Shea, Lady Sink, Martin Leadham, Thistledown, please, Daniel French, Argus Sackart, David Robertson, Zinc, Kevin Midhan, Swift Breeze, Stu Gray, Kono, Paul Fisk, Southern Spectrum, and Grand Article for Alex Cherry and Yavari feature for Darren Thompson. So thirteen then. Over the marathon trip of four miles, and away they go. This final race of day one, what a day it's been, and it's going to be the leader into the first fence. It looks like it might be the grey zinc with the other grey lady sink on the outside. So those two are going to dispute the lead. Crossmaster in third, pulling for its head is Yavari feature. They get to the first of the 25, and they all safely get to the other side. So lady sink. And Zinc are the front two. No doubt some of these will be in the national next week. Maybe one or two of them trying to get a better weight because they're not too far out of the handicap. I know where that one they go. And they're all safe over the one or two nodded on landing. And Lady Sink has won the battle to lead. So Lady Sink then, the orange jacketed grey in front, skips over the third in the lead. From Zinc in second, Yavari feature in third, then a gap of a couple of lengths to Crossmaster, Charlie 2 and Angus Sackart. David Robertson's got two greys in this. Angus Sackart and Isabel Reform. The back marker is just Swift Breeze, which if you listen to the preview show earlier, I know that Stu quite fancies that one's a run a big race. And Lady Sink is the leader, and the trainer of that one doesn't fancy it to run a big race because he totally forgot it was in it and never mentioned it at all. So <laughs> Lady Sink is the leader from Zinc in the second. We have Ari Feature is third. And Crossmaster and Angus Sackart as they take the fourth. And they that one they all go. There's a four right at the back. Southern Spectrum's gone. So Southern Spectrum is out. And at the fifth. Alex Cherry's still got another one in there though. That's a grand article. So the day is not yet over for him. And Lady Sink. A good day it's been as well. With Zinc in second. Yavari feature third. Crossmaster. He's chasing Argus Sackart. And Swift Breeze is still just the tail end Charlie at this point, but they've got to go around another couple of times yet. And this fence will be the last, I think, in a couple of circuits. Time won't be the second last. I'll be the last one at that one. No, they won't. This one will be the last. I'll get it right one day. And over that one they go then. Two more circuits to go. And Lady Sink leads by a length and a half to Zinc in second. And Yavari feature is third. Argus Sackart is fourth. And Crossmaster, and a little gap to Kono. And Grand Article, a couple in the green there. Thistledown, Please, and Charlie, too. And then the three along the line at the back are not now, never. Swift Reform and uh, Swift Breeze and Isabel Reform. So they're all racing uphill then now. The ones that remain just lost a one so far. Southern Spectrum. It's Lady Sink who is in the lead by about two and a half lengths to Zinc in second. So Grey's one and two as they take the ninth. And also Grey back in fourth as well. And the field is quite well strung out now, so Lady Sink must be setting a pretty stiff pace as they make their way towards the next. And Lady Sink over the water in the lead from Zinc in second and Yavari feature. And Argus Sackart and Crossmaster and Grand Article and Kono, then is the very form. Back four are pretty much bunched up. This all down. Please, Swift Breeze, not known ever. And Charlie, too. This is a big ditch, and Lady Sink jumped it well in front. Oh, got over that one well. The order pretty much the same as it has been most of the way so far. Into the next one, then, and Lady Sink over in front. Zinc over in second. Then Yavari feature. Get to Argus Sackart, then Crossmaster and Grand Article. Get to Kono and Isabel Reform. This will down please and swift breeze. And then finally Charlie 2. And not now never at the back. Another ditch coming up then. And a bit of a slow jump by Argus Sackart, but the rest of them all over it okay. And no, they're not. Crossmaster's gone. So Crossmaster was obscured and has fallen. So let's see that one go. And it's Lady Sink in the lead then. Zinc is second. Yavari feature is third. In Grand Article, and Argus Sack up. We're coming after that one, and Isabel Reform and Thistle Down, please. Swift Breeze is next. As they come towards the next. And 
Lady Sink trumping quickly and well in front. And Zink in second. Yavari feature third. That's not changed throughout the entire race. And Grand Ole's got an Argus sack out. So they race downhill towards the next fence. And Lady Sink. In front by a couple of lengths then. Grays to the four, zinc second. Yvari feature is third. And Grandard's going to have a suck out as they swing into the straight. They'll take two fences in this straight. Uh, that's the first of them. Which they're all safely over. And then over that next one. And they're all over that one as well with Lady Sink in the lead then. in there to swing out for one final circuit of the track and it's Lady Sink in the lead Zink is in second Yavari feature is third Grand Article is four and Ang Argus Sakot is fifth then Thistle Down please after that one as they take the 17th and one or two of them getting a little bit tired jumping at the back a little bit sketchily but Lady Sink and Zink are still going well in the lead from Yavari feature and Grand Article Argus Sackart back in fifth. This will down, please. He's getting closer. So to Isabel Reform and Swift Breeze as Lady Sink is almost joined there by Zink. So it's Lady Sink and Zink. And Yavari feature and Grand Article. Isabel Reform. This will down, please. As they come down towards the next. They're getting towards the business end of the race now, then. And that's the water jump. And Lady Sink. That led pretty much all the way. Zink. He's close up in second. Yavari feature and Grand Article getting closer as well in third and fourth. A little gap back to Swift Breeze. They take the next. And Lady Sink didn't jump that one all that well. And Zink just about got into the lead. Zink pokes his head in front for the first time. And Lady Sink is now back into second. Then Grand Article and Yavari found the next one. Oh, Lady Sink's gone. She made a mistake at the one before. And she made another one there. And the jockey had no chance of staying on board. And Zink's been left in the lead. So Zink's in front then now. From Grand Article second. Then Isabel Reform is third. Yavari feature being pushed along in fourth. The ones that are going well now. Looks to be Thistle Down, Please and Swift Breeze. Argus Sackart's also going well as they come to this ditch. This is the 22nd. And over that one they all go then. They've just got for three more to take then now and it's zinc in front isabel reform second it's still grays one and two then grand article is third i'm well, being pushed along again now to try and get back into it is argus sackart but it's stable mate isabel reform who's gone on isabel reform hits the front zinc is second then grand article then yavari features still trying to get there but he's being pushed along thistle down please is also still going well swift breeze is trying to come around the outside but it's isabel reform in the lead from argus sackart stable mate on his outside and zinc on the inside three grades in a line over the third last they go and it's Argus Sackart and Isabel Reform Zinc back in third then Swift Breeze and Charlie too beginning to run on from the back Isabel Reform's gone for home I think with just two to take it's Isabel Reform in the lead then by two lengths to Argus Sackart in second Zinc is back in third then Charlie too and Swift Breeze trying to run on surely between these then now as they come down towards the final couple of fences it's Isabel Reform in front Argus Sackart chasing Zinc's now starting to look one pace Swift Breeze is beginning to run on Charlie too is next then Thistle down, please. As we switch angles, it's Isabel Reform in front. Isabel Reform, the slightly darker of the two greys, comes to the second last. Gets over it nicely. Argus Sackard in second. Here comes Swift Breeze for Stu Gray. It's Isabel Reform in the lead. Swift Breeze, Argus Sackard at the final fence. And Swift Breeze hits it hard. And it's Argus Sackard who's gone on. Argus Sackard then in the lead. Past the final third. And by the go. It's Argus Sackard. Isabel Reform. Swift Breeze is trying to fight back. Toast is zinc. But Argus Sackard's got enough in the tank, I think, to hold on. And up towards the line, Argus Sackard. He's going to take it. Swift Breeze, a big race in second. Close for third. Isabel Reform, Zink and Thistle down. Please and Charlie too. And it's David Robertson that's taken it. David Robertson's winner. Not, not necessarily the one that most of us thought, I don't think. And Argus Sackart has taken it. Swift Breeze has run a big race. Good trial for the National next week. For that one and for one or two of these others as well. So Argus Sackart for David Robertson is the winner. Swift Breeze for Stu Gray second. Charlie two for Thomas Rogers came from nowhere to be third. Zinc for Kevin Minan stuck on well for fourth. And Isabel Reform for the winning trainer David Robertson was fifth. That's your Cheltenham Festival day one done. We'll be back for more tomorrow.